They say when you're on top, there's nowhere to go but down. The biggest, baddest. I'm going to be a one-time champion. Female in the division. It's me. AEW Women's Champion, Nyla Rose, has no intention of relinquishing her title anytime soon. And the Beast Bomb! One, two, three! Nyla Rose has been as dominant a champion in the women's scene that, uh, that I've seen in, in a long, long time. Nobody can beat me! I am the AEW Women's Champion. She's got the attitude. Intensity. I am the leader in this division. The demeanor. Anger. Nasty. I am the top of the mountain. And not only that, man, she believes in herself. She's not unbeatable, as we know, but she's the next thing to it. Last October, when Nyla lost her title match and the opportunity to call herself the first ever against Riho, it merely lit a fuse that has caused grief, oh! pain. Man, she's strong, she's agile, and of course, she's gotta be hostile. And suffering. Oh! Bomb! to every other woman on the AEW roster. I got you a present. Stop. I found your kendo stick, bitch! Donna Rose Cheetah's title match at Double or Nothing will now be, gentlemen, no disqualifications, Tony, and no count out Excalibur. I would not want to be the person on the end of a no disqualification, no count out match against the Native Beast, Nyla Rose. The evolution of the Native Beast's game her impressive size and ferocious tenacity in the ring gives her an immediate advantage over her opponents. To me, it's pretty obvious what Cheetah has to do. It's old school, but you get someone as strong and as powerful and as destructive as Nyla Rose, you can't try to mix it up with her. You try to use your weapons at the beginning of the match against Nyla, Nyla's too strong. I beat it Aja Kong in Japan, so how big she is is not matter for me. I think she's the strongest woman in AEW, but it don't matter. Being able to have this little bit of time off, it's been a little frustrating, but it's also been very welcome. You see, it rejuvenated me. It reignited something in me. But it's her take no prisoners mentality and her affinity for a good table that has propelled her game to the next level. Nala has a chip on her shoulder. I'm not exactly sure why. I personally think that's great. You know how sometimes there's just people that are angry or mean for no reason? Nyla Rose seems to have a lot of bad days. And if that becomes your sole focus, then you become a little bit easier to prepare for. Because we know you're looking for the knockout punch or the submission. And these are all power moves. All these women are clawing after Nyla Rose to try and get after her, namely Sheeta. So you have to get more of an attitude. You have to get. Uh, even, even more angry, you have to get even more violent, more physical, a bigger chip in your shoulder to retain your title. Meanwhile, Hikaru Shida is the hottest wrestler in women's professional wrestling today. Hikaru Shida is, I almost said that Hikaru Shida was like the, the Kenny Omega of the AEW women's division. They're two of the most popular competitors in AEW, and I think Hik Hikaru Shida might be the biggest fan favorite in the AEW women's division. Being champion in this hard time is most important for me. I think this is the best thing what can I do as a wrestler. Her impressive record in 2020 has catapulted her to this prize fight at Double or Nothing. When you take a look at the rankings, I think a lot goes into rankings. Not only win-loss records, I think you gotta look at the way they approach their matches, how they win. You can't deny her a title shot. Japanese style is uh, special, I think. More spirit or hard hit, but if you pull down, stand up again, again, and again. And if I am Nyla Rose, I'm concerned with this. I'm concerned with an athlete like this coming from my championship. Cheetah, since I've been gone, you've done nothing but run through the competition. So why don't you keep doing something you're good at and keep running? I think for me and for every fan, this show will be unforgettable. I feel that Sheeta will become the AW Women's World Champion and defeat Nyla Rose. It will not be easy. Somehow, some way, I think that she pulls it off. 
I can't pick against Nyla Rose. I think she has become one of the more dominant wrestlers, not only in the women's division, but in, in all divisions in AEW. I've always believed that a great wrestler will always be a great brawler. I do believe it'll be one of the more spirited, physical matches of any gender in AEW ever. Tonight, live on pay-per-view at Double or Nothing, Hikaru Shida is just one victory away from becoming an international superstar. Does she have what it takes to slay the beast once and for all and take the title off the most feared woman in professional wrestling today? The reason I'm gonna walk out of Double or Nothing as the AEW Women's Champion is because I'm Nyla Rose and I break bitches.